I was born in Jerusalem, as I said, and uh, we, you know, grew up there when I was uh, up to eight. Then there was a war, so we moved to Lebanon. And then, then there was a war, so we moved again to Saudi Arabia um, during the civil war in Lebanon in 1975. And then when we moved to Saudi Arabia, my parents sent me to boarding school. They sent me to a Catholic Irish school <laughs> in England. It's, um, in, in, it's called Marymount. And I had the most amazing uh, headmistress, uh, Sister Anne-Marie, who taught us all that, that uh, to respect each other and, and, and to respect our differences. My first job was a TV newscaster on Saudi TV. And, and, uh, and that, that was a learning experience for me. And they had me read news in the middle of the biggest football game and it was a huge story in the news a young girl is reading the news in, <laughs> in half time and the minister called me and he's like um, you know lena this is this was a terrible mistake we did and from now on you can only uh, you, uh, you can only speak and do continuity but you can never be on tv again like your face because you're a woman and and it's you know it, it's, we, we have to stop young, any woman under the age of 35 to, you know, to be on TV. And I quit. I'm like, no way, I will not accept that just because I'm a young woman. So the, it was even institutionalized. And that's changed a lot since then. You're the one who has to reject it and you have to say, I don't accept this. And you make people think when you say no. I worked in Jordan. In Jordan, I used to work for UNICEF. And, and that's when I, st when I uh, worked at the time. It was Princess Rania, now she's Queen Rania to start the first child protection agency in the Middle East. And in 2000, I moved to the United States. In Islam, they, there's a lot of respect for women's rights, but in our culture and our tradition, uh, it's evolved into a, a, a culture that's, that really kind of discriminates about, against women's rights. So that's been my calling, is to really fight for women's rights and make it a little bit more equal. When I see young people being discriminated against because of their sexual orientation, especially where I come from, because it's a huge difference from the USA, um, it, 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 to me, that's a huge injustice. And, uh, and any kind of discrimination for me, it's an injustice. We are all God's you know, children, and we are all made the way we are, and, and we're all special in the way we are. Thank you.